Hi there, and thanks for clicking. Um, my name is Kelsey. Welcome back to my channel, or welcome to my channel um, if you're new. And if you are new, please remember to hit the subscribe button down below. And um, also follow me on Instagram at KelseSense. I'm almost at 530 followers, which is crazy because I made that Instagram, uh, Instagram, Instagram in like J June or July, I think. And I didn't really start mass posting until I would say like uh, August, September. So, I mean, I, I feel like I built up a good, a good following within like the last like six months. So, Super proud of myself there. So yeah, if you have an Instagram, go and follow me at KelseSense. Also hit the like and subscribe buttons uh, down below. And yeah, uh, I know it's, yeah, it is 5 p.m. and I'm in pajamas, but you know what? I work today. Today's Sunday. I'm just gonna have a nice lazy day. I got a sub from Subway, so I'm probably just gonna lay in bed, watch some movies on my laptop, and eat a sub. So <laughs> I figured I would film my video first before I get too tired. So I literally just got back, like I just got back, put my pajamas on, started recording um, from the mall. Today's the last day of semi-annual sale, as you guys know. But um, a lot of the times, if your store has a lot of products, they'll run the semi-annual sale for like a few days longer, maybe, you know, like almost a week longer. Because they have to get rid of all that black raspberry vanilla, country apple, cucumber melon. A lot of the times they don't put it back in the back, they'll try to sell most of it so i'm sure for the next few days my store will still be offering some 75 percent off items but it does end um online at 6 a.m technically tomorrow so so oh, well 5 59 so it ends at 5 59 a.m so if you get home from work and you're like oh i couldn't go to the mall today not a big deal you can still check out the stuff online there's really not that many um 75 percent off items or 50 percent off items left but we do have still have some like four dollar pocket back sets that you could pick up and also it's $10 off three wick candles. And that's what I'm going to show you guys today. So I don't really do a lot of candle buys, but all the spring candles that were coming out, I was like, oh my gosh, like I love these. And I did get a 20% off coupon yesterday. And I only like to use my 20% offs on candles and expensive things like that. Cause most of the body care I do exchanges for, or I use my rewards, but I can never usually, uh, never use my rewards for candles, obviously. So I went in there today to try to get four or five candles. I ended up getting four just because the bag was super, super heavy and I didn't want to have to grab another one. So I did get four candles and four soaps today and then I used my 20% off. So I did spend $66, which yeah, that's like a lot of money, but when you're getting four candles and four soaps, like it's a really, really good deal. Normally it would be like 120. Like yeah, I saved $65. So I saved pretty much as much as I spent, which is good. So, like I said in, like I said, I went in and I had to grab a big bag because I knew I was going for the candles. They didn't have any big Bath and Body Works bags, they just a big white barn bag. So I picked up one of those and I went straight to the candles. Um, and the first one I ended up picking up was uh, one I already have actually, but I ended up loving it so much that I was like, okay, I have to get a second one no matter what. And that is the pink watermelon. This candle is so amazing, you guys. I was burning it. The throw was amazing. My whole smell, my whole house smells like pink watermelon. It smells so good. Even my boyfriend likes it. So that's how you know it's really, really good. And it just smells like candy, like watermelon candy. Literally, literally making my mouth water, guys. That's how amazing this candle is. If you love fruity, sweet smells, You'll de any, if you like watermelon lemonade, you'll absolutely love pink watermelon. The scent notes are juicy pink watermelon, sugared strawberry blossoms, and lime zest. Yes, guys, this candle is amazing. Probably, this honestly might be my new favorite candle, guys. It's so good. I should have gotten just four of these. <laughs> so I did get another uh, pink watermelon. Next one I picked up was from the new kind of like fruity collection like the aloha kiwi passion fruit market peach i picked up the sugar lemonade because i really like lemon smells and i like nice sweet smells so i figured this would be a good pairing and it is it smells so good it smells like hmm like it smells like something familiar but i can't put my finger on it it kind of smells like a lemon candy like a nice lemon candy oh this one also makes my mouth water they're so good this is the fresh lemon juice, sugar crystals, and crushed ice, which ice doesn't have a smell. It's water. Water doesn't smell like anything. 
I think they just put that to be cute, you know, but sugar lemonade packaging is really cute. I like the the jar, how it's not clear, but it's not like um, opaque. It's translucent. That's what it is. But yeah, it just smells so freaking good. I love this can. Oh, there's my cat right on cue. Every video he's walking by, I swear. So yeah, those were two I picked up, like two ones that I knew for sure I was going to get. And then I walked around for a few minutes, smelled a lot of the different candles. I smelled like the uh, perfect spring. That's too fresh for me. I smelled the fresh orange. That one I was like, no. Market peach and peach bellini don't really do it for me. The banana bunk cake didn't really smell that good. Um, I think banana cabana might be an online exclusive because I didn't see that one at my store. So I was walking around and I figured I would go over to the Valentine's Day candles like the um, bubbly rosé, whipped coffee, wildberry jam donut. I went over to those. Um, I did buy the coffee one online. That is coming. Um, and I smelled a lot of the other ones. I smelled the wild or the pink lilac and vanilla. Just a little bit too floral for me. But I did find one. Jack, get off the table. I, I put my sub down for five seconds. He's trying to get... He, he knows he's not supposed to be on the kitchen table. All I have to do is tell him, get down. Anyways... I picked up the pink apple punch because I really like the packaging on all of these candles. The lids are so cute too. And this one just smells amazing. I did pick up the room spray of this um, maybe like a week ago and I really, really like the smell. So I figured I would try the candle out. It smells super good. It's crisp apples, sun-kissed melon, and sugar crystals. It's funny. Every time I see this candle, I think of um, Tina Marie's video of her daughter, Grace, um, picking out her candles, describing all the notes. She's like, it smells like cherries, strawberries, blueberries, lime. Like, she's just so cute. She lists off, like, every fruit, like, ever created. And she's like, it smells like this, this. I just think that that's so cute. Like, she'll be like, this one smells like apples and cherries and strawberries. <laughs> like, I just thought that was adorable. So every time I see this candle, I just think of uh, Tina Marie's daughter and how she described, like, all the different fruits. I just thought that was really cute. So Pink Apple Punch is definitely... A really good candle. I'm really loving fruity candles right now. So it's thank God like spring came around because normally I feel like during spring they bring out a lot of flower candles like the fresh cut lilacs, you know, um, flourish, uh, yeah, the perfect spring, all those ones. And I'm just not into flower scented candles. So I really like the fruity ones. I did pick up one more candle and that was also from like the same kind of line, but uh, no, I guess it's not from the same line. It's from the, um, what is this line even called? Does it have a name? Bakery. Bakery line. So this is the new bake shop line. And I, gra I grabbed the coconut cream pie because I do not care for strawberry pound cake in the candle. Except for today, they were burning. Well, they had like an oil of strawberry pound cake and it smelled so good. But like, I don't know, because last time I had a strawberry pound cake candle, I burned it and it smelled so dusty and I didn't like it. But when I was smelling it today at the store, I liked it. But you know what? I was like, you know what? I'm not going to even risk buying this and then hating it again. So I decided to pick up the coconut cream pie. This one smells really, really good too. It does have an, a, like a, a coconut scent, which normally I don't like. But I don't like coconut scents on my body. I like them in the air. Like I can buy a coconut scented room spray or wallflower. But I wouldn't buy a coconut spray, uh, body spray. Or like lotion or something. So I did buy the coconut cream pie candle. Lid is super cute as well. And then this is the toasted coconut flakes, caramel custard, and golden pie crust. Smells really, really good. I'm super excited to burn this one. Um, I'm scared it's going to be kind of light like the body care is. But maybe I'll burn it like in my room or the bathroom or something. Because yeah, this one smells super good. But yeah, like I said, it is kind of light. Like you have to take a a whiff to, you know, like a big inhale to get the smell. Um, packaging is really, really cute. It's kind of raised up, like it's texturized a little bit. And yeah, those were my candles I got. And I was like, all right, I'm gonna stop. I'm gonna look at the 75% off stuff. They had nothing good for 75% off. They had so much cucumber melon, which I already have a, like a, like so many cucumber melon items. I have, uh, there was country apple, don't care for that. Black raspberry vanilla, Moonlight Path, all those. They had the Men's Forest, but only in the cream. 
um they had some pink cashmere i'm just not into any of those scents and they had so many wallflowers but they were all fresh balsam all fresh just buckets of fresh balsam and i'm like no i don't think i'm gonna get any semi-annual stuff so i didn't get any semi-annual stuff for the last day of semi-annual sale but i did walk over to the soaps and i noticed a soap sitting there by his lonesome and i said oh if you're here then where's the other one and the one i saw sitting there was treat yourself blueberry uh glazed donut people say that this is a repackage of blueberry crumble but the notes are different it says blueberry glaze fresh baked donut and sprinkles so let me smell and let me tell you if it smells like blueberry crumble oh yep it does <laughs> yep it smells exactly like blueberry crumble but i don't even care the packet ah, it's leaking all over me I'm getting soapy they gotta have a makeup wipe right here. Uh, okay, but yeah, the packaging is super cute that I don't even care that it's the same size blueberry crumble because the packaging is so freaking cute. I love a little winking donut. But yeah, that's why I only got one of this soap because I did hear it was a repackage, but I read the notes and I was like, sprinkles, I don't know, it might be a little bit sweeter. But no, it smells exactly like the blueberry crumble soap. So if you end up, if you ended up really liking that soap and you don't have any more, pick this up. And if you ended up not liking that soap, don't pick this up. So that's the first soap I grabbed. And then, like I said, I was like, okay, if you're here, then the milkshake one has to be here, right? And it was. I got the What Shaken Cookies and Cream Milkshake Soap. This smells exactly like the Cookies and Cream Milkshake Candle, which I do have. It smells exactly like it, like to a T. Oh my gosh, why are all these soaps leaking everywhere? Oh my goodness. Oh. I'm gonna have to get a whole new makeup wipe. Okay. Jeez. Okay. <laughs> Sorry. I don't want. I don't want everything to be all sticky and soapy. Okay. So that was. Those are the two I got from that collection. I didn't pick up the cucumber melon, or the strawberry lemon, just because I like really different smells. So I, I picked up those two, and then I was like, well, if I got two soaps, I have to get like at least two more to do the four for twenty. So I picked up two more soaps, and I picked up the coconut cream pie soap. I was going to get the strawberry pound cake, but I was like, no, I have a lot of strawberry scented soaps. I don't have any coconut soap. So this is caramel, oh, toasted coconut flakes, caramel custard, and golden pie crust. I think it's the same exact notes as the candle. It is. Let's see if it smells exactly like the candle. Let's see. Pretty close. It has more of a coconut smell than anything. But it's still a really nice soap. Packaging's cute. So now I have this in like almost like every single product. I have the lotion. Um, I bought the cream, I think. Uh, oh, there is no shower gel. And I have the spray. So I think I have it in every product that it comes in. Because I had the lip gloss. I just need to get the hand cream. Which um, they do have those at my store. But I didn't want to pick up those up today. So I didn't get that. But I did get one more soap, and that's like one of my favorite soaps ever. And I really wanted to get it in the Gentle Gel because the fruity line of the Gentle Gel hand soaps, like the white, I think that's so cute. The white and the colors pair perfectly together. But I did grab the foaming watermelon lemonade and not the Gentle Gel just because I don't really like the Gentle Gel. So I would only be buying it for the packaging, which is really not worth it. So I did pick up this one. Watermelon lemonade and the foaming hand soap. It's watermelon ice, sparkling water, and Meyer lemon. Just a classic, oh my goodness, a classic watermelon lemonade smell. I really love this soap. I buy it every single time I see it. It has the same consistent, nice smell, watermelon lemonade. So yeah, definitely got some cute soaps. I know I said I was gonna stop buying soaps, but you know, I don't listen to myself. So <laughs> I did get those. I did buy seven soaps online the other day, but those are specifically for work. I'm bringing seven soaps to work, putting them under the thing. That way when a soap runs out, they can just take a new one and I don't have to keep bringing them to work. And they were all under $2 and I used a 10 off 40. So that is why I bought seven soaps online. They're not for me, but these ones are because they're super cute. I love these soaps. So that was everything. Um, Let's see. So... Uh, I'm trying to see. Okay, see, the candles ended up being 11.60 each, so they're normal. They're supposed to be 14.50, but 
but they're eleven sixty. I saved like twenty dollars with my twenty percent off coupon, which is amazing. And I was telling myself like maybe you shouldn't use it right away. Maybe you should save it when new stuff comes out. But like I already got the whole new bakery line. I have rewards for that. So if any new like body care items come out, I'll mostly just uh, most likely just use my rewards. And so I figured the twenty percent off would be best used in my candle haul. Also, I did take a picture of the back of my coupon because sometimes you can use the coupons twice. It just really depends on which coupon it is. Like your 10 off 40 for SAS, you could use that online and in the store. So I did take a picture of my coupon just in case. I doubt it'll work, but you know what? It's never, never hurts to try. So yeah, that is my video for today, guys. I got four candles, four soaps. Um, my favorite candle out of all of these is obviously the pink watermelon. Like I said, this is definitely like my... Uh, well, we'll have to see. It's like, we're days into 2021. I'm like, this is my favorite candle, 2021. But I'll have to see. Wait and see for the rest of the year. But this is definitely my favorite candle right now. I burned it for a few hours yesterday, the day before. I just love it so much. It just smells so sweet and fruity. Like candy makes your mouth water. And all right, gonna wrap it up right here, guys. Thank you guys so much for watching. Um, remember, like I said, remember to hit the like and subscribe buttons down below. Follow me on Instagram at Kels Sense. I know I said my next video was gonna be my bakery review, but I'm gonna wait until my stuff online comes before I do that review. So I'll have the full like collection for you guys. So I'll see you guys in the next video.